Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing? I know I haven't talked to you in a very long time. I think the last time I talked to you was in September. I think that was the last time. And it is now uh, mid-March. And a lot has happened since then. A whole, a whole lot. I could have vlogged. Did I vlog for Vlogmas? No. I could have had a whole thing, a whole life adventure with you guys, but I didn't do it. I've had the urge to um, do an update video and let you guys know where I am, what I'm doing. Um, so I figured today is the day I am off and why not? I felt like my hair was looking good. So I figured, you know, <laughs> you know, we, I've delivered the mail, so the hair does not always look good. Well, it never looks good when I'm delivering the mail, but anyway, uh, so I figured I would check in, say hello, see how you're doing. We are in a new location right now um, because in um, mid-November, I had to move out of my house. My landlord sold it. Um, I had a, uh, a month to pack, move all this stuff uh, in the middle of Christmas season at the post office. You can imagine not easy. I managed it. I managed it. Um, I am staying, living with uh, one of my very good friends. Thankfully, um, she let me stay here until I found a place for myself, which has been a nightmare. <laughs> it's been a nightmare. I mean, we're in mid-March. Um, so looking for a place, working at the post office is, uh, it's, a, it's a lot. But anyway, Yes, November, I uh, moved out. Um, then in December, I got COVID. I did. I was one of the people that said, oh, I'm not going to get it. I'm not going to get it. But I got it. I got it. Um, and right about the time I got COVID was when I was moving out, coming to stay with my good friend, um, which I did. I spent my COVID time in a hotel <laughs> quarantining um, because you know you don't want to pass it along to other people so that meant uh, Christmas I did not see my child I was in a hotel Christmas I ate Chinese food on Christmas Day um, but I made it out and I'm better now obviously um, came here work trying to find a place um, Let's see. I will probably make another video um, because I feel like I'm rambling a lot in this video and I'm only a few minutes in. Um, but yeah, I was super, super grateful um, that she let me stay here uh, because by the time I was ready to move out of my house, I didn't, I was not ready to move in to my own place because of, you know, work and Christmas and oh my God, Christmas, which with all the stimulus check, all of that, it just feels like Christmas every day at the post office. It really does. I mean, it's ridiculous the amount of packages. It's crazy. But I think that I am the only person right now that probably has not received their stimulus check. I have not. I don't know. Am I the only person? Have you gotten your stimulus check? Because I haven't. I have not. And I could definitely use it because... Uh, I am moving the 1st of April. I found a place. I'm super excited. Um, I, it'll be really fun to show you guys uh, where it's at and apartment tour and all that fun stuff. So, um, yeah, I definitely will show you that. But, yeah, I, I have not gotten my stimulus check. And that's kind of annoying when a lot of my friends are like, yeah, I got my stimulus check, you know. Um, and I have not. <laughs> but, I mean, eventually I guess I will get it. Uh, but anyway, yeah, so uh, eventually I found a place uh, moving in uh, April 1st. And yeah, there's probably a lot more to tell, but I can't. I just, I, I woke up today and I was like, you know what? I'm going to make a video. And I sat down in front of the window so we can have some light. <laughs> and here we go. Um, but I think the last time I talked to you was in September when my heart was broken in half. <laughs> I think so. Uh, but I did take that video down. So, uh, but I would like to say that my heart has come back together. Even though a lot of my friends were very hesitant and um, 
didn't think it was such a good idea, but, um, I guess you have to make your own decisions and do what makes you happy. And, um, he definitely makes me happy. And I would like to say as cliche as it might sound, which I guess it might sound cliche, but maybe the break that we had and the space that we had, maybe we needed that. I don't know because, um, everything is so much better now and I'm so much happier now and it's, it's a much better relationship now. And anyway, that's all I wanted to say about that, but it is, I know a lot of my friends are just, and I feel like some of them are still against it, but I don't anyway, anyway, but we, we both will be moving in April um, to the cutest apartment. I love it so much. I can't wait to show you guys. It's, um, literally right across the street from the beach, which will be really cool for the summer. Um, yeah, it has a pool. It's not super expensive. Um, because I wanted to make sure, I wanted to make sure that, you know, things happen just like last summer. I didn't expect my heart to go, you know what I'm saying? So I didn't want to move into a place where it was going to be, um, expensive and I couldn't afford it on my own. Not to say that I think that that's going to happen again, but you never know. So it is affordable. Um, and I'm taking two, two of my cats. Brian has four of my cats. And then, um, my other good friend has another cat. Um, so I can only have two animals, which brings me to Henry. Where's Henry? Henry is not here. Henry passed away um, Valentine's Day weekend. So uh, it was very, very unexpected. So yeah, he was my buddy. Henry, actually his birthday it was Valentine's Day and he was 12 and he just got sick. I, even the vet, they didn't know, they couldn't tell me what happened. So yeah, I don't think that I'll be getting a dog anytime soon. I think, I don't think so. I still miss him. Sometimes I come home and I, and for a, a, a second, I think, oh, I need to take him outside or he's, I got to take him for a walk or I need to feed him, you know, but yeah, my poor little buddy. But yeah, so we're just going to take the cats and then leave it at that. The rats are gone. The hamster has gone. Um, so I'm down to two cats. But, of course, Brian um, has the rest of the cats, and that's where they shall remain. So, anyway, um, how have you guys been doing? I hope that you had a good Christmas, a good New Year. I hope uh, you're doing well. Did you get COVID? Was it horrible? I didn't like it. A lot of, a lot of chills, very cold and very hot. Had horrible headaches. I didn't, it was horrible. Uh, are you getting the COVID vaccination? Uh, there was talk that they might make it mandatory at work to have us vaccinated, but I don't think it's going to, I, I mean, I get, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about the vaccination. I need to read more into it, but I don't think they're going to make us, uh, make it a mandatory thing. So we will see, but work is doing, uh, very nicely. I made regular in September of last year and I have my very own route now and um, we're moving along. Yeah, I like my route. Um, it's about 14 miles long, but I mean, you get used to it. You walk it every single day. Um, people are nice. There's only a few crazy dogs. <laughs> There's one dog that wants to rip my throat out every day and I don't understand why, but we both have a mutual hatred for each other. So it's okay. But yeah, uh, work is good. And I guess right now it's the middle of March and, um, all my stuff is sitting in a storage unit. So I'm waiting to be able to move into this apartment and then I guess I will feel like everything I don't know. I just feel like the last couple of months, ever since November, when I got the notice that I had to move out of my house, like my life, just everything has just been just upside down. You know, it's just been, God, it's been a long, a long couple of months. And 
some of the, some of the time has been great, but then some of the time has not been great. It just it's been a lot because I what I had lived in that house for twelve months, so I mean twelve years. So I don't know trying to find a new place and then moving and packing twelve years of things and my stuff is in storage right now and it's just been it's been a lot and my dog um, but thankfully thankfully and gratefully um, my good friend let me stay here until I could get everything you know sorted and situated and have time to look for a place which I was scared I wasn't gonna find a place sounds so easy to find a place well uh, for me it was not okay because I work 10 hours a day 75 days a week so it's hard to talk to these apartment people and, and try to go look at an apartment this and that blah 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 this apartment that we're moving into has was the only apartment that we looked at but it's so cute I really like it and I'm pretty excited but anyway I just wanted to check in and I probably forgot a few things so um, maybe I'll make another video I thought it would be kind of cool to show you the apartment and different things so I'm just trying to think of how I could what it could do. I'm not going to sit here and say that I'm going to vlog every day because we all know I'm not. Uh, I just don't have time. I miss it so much, but I don't have time. So I'm just trying to think of maybe a weekly vlog. I don't know. Where was I going? I don't even know. I was on a tangent. Anyway, guys, I just wanted to pop in and say hello. I hope you're doing well. Just wanted to update. I got the urge to talk to you guys. It's been a long time. And um, maybe I will make a do a weekly vlog, something I can manage. I don't want to make promises I can't keep because I'm good at doing that on the vlog. All right, guys, I'm going to wrap it up. I feel like this is a lot of rambling. I'm at 18 minutes right now of rambling all over the place. And I'm going to sit down and try to edit. But I hope you're doing well. And... Um, Hopefully I can get a put a vlog up soon or maybe just another sit down video or something because I wanted to do a vlog but then I figured I couldn't do a vlog until I did a you know hi I'm live video first and then I just set up a random vlog but maybe I will do a vlog we'll see um, but I'm gonna go for now I hope you have a good day I hope you're doing well and I will talk to you soon bye guys